So it's been 46 hours total that I've played Absolver. 45 of those 46 hours I've played as a tank. Should you try it? I'll let you know right now. Tanking an Absolver is basically fighting with one hand tied behind your back. When you win, you're badass. When you lose, you're like a goddamn idiot. The point of Absolver is to be the quickest, the strongest, and the most skilled warrior you can possibly be. Take speed, throw that shit out the window. Look at my ability, 10. <laughs> I am goddamn slow. Trust me. When it comes to points, strength, mobility, and endurance, you know, your three standard tank stats, they're gonna be your best friend. And especially when you got some charge attacks in your decks, you can put up a fight. The only problem is, your weakness is gonna be Windfall Dexterity, which is, you know, the most popular character build in the game. So most of the time, you're not having a good time. I just don't know how to. I don't know how to get close to this guy, man. He's just fucking fast. Ah! 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 What the fuck, dog? He's whooping my ass. But that's why they got round two, bitch. fucking hate myself now so essentially unless you're finding a normal or slow speed character you're gonna get dicked around I mean you can take a hit I mean look at me taking an 18 hit combo here but shit <laughs> doesn't matter how many hits you can take if you can't land anything you know but when you do land trust me it's just you just gotta hope Hope to God they run out of stamina so you can land a couple of hits. But the truth is, I I wouldn't really tank as an absorber. It's just not very, you know, it's just stressful as hell. I mean, if you can take an L, yeah, sure, by all means, you can go ahead and tank because trust me, when you're tanking, it just feels so damn good to win. But if you're if you're the type of person who can't take an L and you you just hate losing this is not for you this is just not a very competitive build you know it's fun it's badass it looks cool but it just doesn't have a good win rate that's, that's all I can basically say about it but when you're finding another tank it's fun as hell ooh spat boy time tank on tank let's go I like it, I like it. Tank on tank, man. It's the best thing that can happen to you. He's almost sleep. Damn, he almost got the same outfit too. Put your hands up, boy. I really like his mask, though. Where, where the hell did you get that? You see, he's not windfall. He's forsaken. You like that mistake, man. You're not going to get that. Point is, since you're so slow, you're throwing off the other guys, uh, the other guys, you know, like rhythm, because he's so used to probably block parrying a lot of other faster guys. You're throwing off his rhythm. How he ain't gonna parry my ass? I can tell you that. Real bad mistake, there, hombre. Oh shit, I'm doing no. It's <laughs> with the sword, though. Hell of a lot of cut absorption. That's dope. See, you're not gonna do it. You, you should have gone to uh, uh, absorb and. Fuck there, Come on, dude. Come on, bro. Put your hands up. Put your hands Do something, bro. Parry me. Do something. Did he give up? Is he here, okay? Yo, he gave up. See? Tank on tank, man. I'm the, I'm the grandmaster of tanks, bro. Don't go forsaken if you can't parry. I like this guy. He's like the exact middle ground. He's not too fast, but not too slow. He's half naked, half armored, and he's also half ass too, because shit, I'm over here whooping his ass. Let's go. I 
want that attack. I want that the the uh, double X, whatever the hell that that move is called. I want that bad. I will rematch this guy. Just, just let him beat me the hell up with that. One. But I always say, if you're gonna tank, don't don't go parry. He has a lot of charges on his I didn't expect that. <laughs> hey, didn't I? Hey, I, I whooped that guy's ass early, I remember. <laughs> oh, round four. No, round five. Let's go. Put your hands up, boy. Get ready for another ass whooping. <laughs> Let's go. They didn't want to fucking go through that bullshit again. Yo, DJ, put a nigga back to the record, baby, and give me this.